Okay, artist, we are all set to make our Frank Lloyd Wright full stained glass window outside. So you guys have to go outside, decide where this place to go. If you notice, I'm busy sweeping the area that I'm going to be using because it's really important to clean your spot. So it could be on a sidewalk, a driveway, any of the areas that you have around your house that you can just go outside and, and draw on. So boys and girls, our first step is to take a peek at our sketchbooks that we made our initial thumbnail drawings on, or our practice drawings. And so I have my practice drawings on, in my sketchbook, and I started making my tape on, on my driveway. And so you can see, I'm starting to begin to place the design on the inside. First I made a rectangle. And then I'm adding those detailed designs carefully with the tape. And you can use any type of tape for this. I wanted to use a bit of wider tape so I would have more space in between. The space in between a stained glass window is called tracery. And the reason it's called tracery is usually there's something called leading in between. And that holds the two pieces of glass together. In our case, we're making faux faux stained glass and so our tracery is just tape. Oh now I have to get out my chalk supplies. Now you could use pastels they'll give you a bit of a bright vibrant color but all I had was sidewalk chalk. So I'm tracing the edges of it and then using two colors and blending them together. And I'm doing that blending with my finger. You could do it with a cloth or a paper towel that's really up to you. But by adding that extra color around the outside of some of my shapes, that should emphasize my design. And that's our goal as an artist, is to make our design stand out and to make everyone look and see. And so hopefully people will stop by your house and just take a peek at your beautiful art. So that means we need to sign our name on our artwork so I've added my name, a husky paw, because at Summit, we're huskies. At Greenland, you might want to add a star instead. So I've added the date 2020. Now I'm ready to remove my stencil that I made or the tracery that I made on my stained glass. So I've removed it. I'm all set. And now I can enjoy your art. I hope you enjoy your art. I'll see you next week.